making sure that it's sound and safe. If it isn't, that would pose a huge problem for southbound I-5. In the meantime, Denise joining us from the live desk. Back to this map and showing where this current derailment is right down here south of DuPont. Again, as you mentioned, Amtrak reporting that there are some injuries that we don't have any additional information on that. Traffic is being diverted off the freeway. This is exit 118. If you're familiar with the area, it's just before you get to Mounts Road. Unfortunately, a lot of people are stuck in a back of thousands of cars. Uh, here is a look at one of those cars approaching where tr before traffic is being pushed off the freeway and this backup extends all the way to J JBLM. It is about a four mile backup I'm turning to another camera so you can see just the pain, uh, uh, the crunch on I-5. A lot of traffic just stuck and sitting there. If you're familiar with this area, there are not a lot of alternate routes. There are some, but those two, those surface streets, are seeing a lot of heavy traffic on them as well. As we mentioned, all lanes of southbound I-5 at Mounts Road are currently blocked because train, Amtrak train, 501 currently diverted. And so we're going to continue to show you all of these cameras. And if you know someone that has plans to jump on the freeway, tell them to sit tight until we uh, get more information, not only about this crash, but at this point, we have no word on when this stretch of I-5 at Mounds Road down in the